is John Penagel, fifth pro boxing fans, joined by Frank Smith. Just seen Josh Warrington become two-time world champion, stopping Kika Martinez. Frank, your immediate reaction? Great win. Unbelievable atmosphere as always for Josh Warrington, but what a performance as well. You know, he went in there from the first round and, you know, he showed a lot of confidence, you know, because he's had a hard ride after that uh, Maurizio Lara, the first Maurizio Lara fight. And I think this, this fight will give him a lot of confidence. So respect to Josh Warrington, two-time world champion and truly deserves it. How tough was Kiko in there? Yeah, Kiko, you know, Kiko always, he's always he's always going to be dangerous. And like I say, Josh, you know, Josh, a lot of respect to him. Ebony Bridges, world champion. What did you make of it? Great win for Ebony Bridges. She's, you know, she's got a huge future and what a character as well. You know, she's got a huge following um, and great for Australian boxing. You know, we've invested heavily in, into Australian boxing, looking forward to many big nights out there. So that's definitely something for us. And Ebony's got some big fights ahead of her, whether, you know, it's a Shannon Courtney rematch. Uh, you've got Jamie Mitchell, who, who you know, is a WBA champion. Let's see, but big fights out there for her. Just a couple quick ones. Uh, what's next for Josh, in your opinion? Lee Wood, Leo Santa Cruz? I think he's got a bit of a rest now. You know, he's injured his yeah. jaw, he's injured his hand. So let's let's go through that. Let's see how the process uh, goes with that. But, you know, he's world champion again. He's got, you know, he's got many opportunities. Vegas is definitely one he's interested in. Um, so let's see. Lee Wood would be a massive fight, whether it's at the city ground or whether it's Ellen Road. You know, that would be a that would be an argument in its own right. And just two two more uh, reports in boxing scene today that uh, Haney Cambosis, if he gets made, will be on ESPN, not the zone. Uh, can you clarify? But we, you know, we're obviously worked with Haney for a long time. We're still working through things, and as soon as there's an update, we'll keep you updated. And just last one, uh, we spoke about Fury White the other day. Um, I think before the press conference. Since then, Eddie said that he would be willing to carry White's spit bucket. What do you he make would. of that? I mean, or bucket rather. You know, I think he'd be very good at it. I think he'd be overqualified, to be honest. Um, I've seen him carry a spit bucket before. He, he's very good with a handle. Um, and, you know, I think I'd give him the job. Are you going to be there at the fight? I don't know, maybe in a disguise. Frank, appreciate it.